Welcome back to another episode of Monster Truck Destruction as we get set as Motor Madness goes live for freestyle. Western Renegade, Boogie Van, Bad Habit, Bigfoot, and USA One all competing here tonight for the Freestyle Championship. Up first, we've got Barry Parkin in the Western Renegade Hummer. Now, isn't this one sweet looking ride as he gets some good air for his first leap of the night so far? This is the first time we have seen the Western Renegade on Motor Madness, and let me tell you, this is one sweet looking piece. Barry Parkin took the old Dragon Slayer Hummer and has created the Western Renegade as a huge leap over top of the buses, gets it into a nice slap wheelie, trying to keep a good consistent run here going. Good leap over top the center of the track and going after the vans now. Up and over, gets a little crooked. He has it all under control. Breaking through the RVs, that's a signature of the Western Renegade. Up and over the buses one more time, kicks him to the side, brings it back around. Can he save it? And he's got the truck under control. What a wild ride that was. Ladies and gentlemen, we hope to see more of the Western Renegade out here on Motor Madness for our Monster Truck Destruction Tour. Great slap lead right there, Barry Parkin, driving that Hummer of the Western Renegade. Putting on a pretty solid performance. Big wow factor earlier when he saved the truck after getting it a little bit out of control, but so far, so good. Barry Parkin keeping up some really great momentum, and he's gonna go through this set of RVs and making a mess all over the arena floor. Gonna tackle the buses heavy on the nose and he's gonna roll the truck over and that'll be a wrap for Barry Parkin in the Western Renegade. Next up is Pam Vodders in that boogie van Ford out of Hagerstown, Maryland. Now, Pam Vodders is no slouch to the series as she used to compete with the big boys in the Penda Points Championship back in the mid 1990s. Great leap over top of that bus. Incredible momentum so far so good as she goes back over the bus one more time with an incredible leap some sick air by Pam Vodders in that boogie van forward. And how cool is this thing? I mean, the soccer moms would absolutely love it. Pack the kids up, maybe go to the store, get a few things. But not only are you just in your minivan, you're on 66-inch tall monster truck tires. Vodders now destroying the motor home. Back up over the cars now and looking for some donuts. Let's see if she can really crank them out. There it goes. Got that minivan out there doing some wild donuts. Looks like she's going back over the buses now with another huge leap, hard on the left-hand side, but she keeps the truck together as she goes over the center of the track one more time into an incredible slap wheelie. And looks like she's gonna take out the buses again. Sick air up with a combo and make that a triple. Hold the fries and she goes over top and now she's going right back through the RV. Into the side, can she save it? Brought it back down on all fours. Oh, sticks the side of the bus, not quite a backflip, but she didn't quite go over it. And she fires the boogie van back up, it had shut off there for a minute. Gonna try the buses one more time, says it won't conquer her. Sick air! Oh my! And that'll be a wrap for Pam Botters in the boogie van. Up next is none other than Joey Sylvester in the Bad Habit Machine. Now, Joey Sylvester took his Bad Habit truck and set the Guinness World Record for the longest jump set in a monster truck. However, he was soon to be beat out by none other than Team Bigfoot with Dan running behind the wheel. Now Bigfoot holds the record for the longest jump ever set in a monster truck. Oh, Sylvester in trouble right there, trying to keep the truck together, laying down a pretty consistent pass right now. Haven't seen that big wow factor just yet, but he's only been on the track for a few seconds. Let's see as he goes over top of those crush cars, going to hit this dirt mobile and really get that truck way up in the air. All night long, they've been having a hard time with that truck nosing over. They dealt with it in racing, got bumped out in the semifinals, and they are still cranking and working. Oh, my! Oh, my! Unbelievable! And now his adrenaline is kicking. Ladies and gentlemen, what an incredible move by Joey Sylvester in the bad habit as he front flipped over top. As much as you want to call it a front flip, the top of the truck slammed into the ground, but that's why these guys wear all this safety gear. We are strapped in with racing harnesses, neck collars, full suit, fire suits, I mean, and helmets. And let me tell you, as he skies that bad habit out one more time, really laying down a great pass. You know that blood is flowing through his veins as he just conquered over that front flip and really laying down a great pass. He's going to hit the buses one more time up and over. As you can see, heavy on the nose and he's over. And that'll be a wrap for Joe Sylvester in the bad habit. Up next out of the Bigfoot camp is Gene Patterson and Bigfoot 10. Huge air right out of the gate. That's how you announce your presence in freestyle. 
Ladies and gentlemen, he had to be at least 40 to 45 feet in the air with that big foot forward. Unbelievable. Right out of the gate, he just launched it. Now he sky wheelies that thing right over top of the ramp, looking like he's a little bit in trouble trying to get Bigfoot back under control as he leaps over the buses. Unbelievable. Can you believe that entrance he just made? Back over the buses now with another great leap and going to hit the mobile in the center of the track. What a beautiful looking truck, by the way. Bob Chandler and company have really put their computer design together as that truck will handle anything that the team throws at it. Patterson out here now looking to make a spectacular performance in a slap wheelie. Oh, he's in trouble. Patterson in trouble, but he gets the truck back together. What a save by Gene Patterson and Bigfoot. Lining up for the bus one more time. Up and over, heavy on the nose. Combos it up a little bit into a slap wheelie up and over the van. Oh my, Patterson is on a rail here tonight. Unbelievable performance from Bigfoot 10. Going over the bus. Oh, kicked him to the side a little bit on two wheels. Can he save it? And he's over. Let's go back and have another look. Gene Patterson launches over the bus. It kicks him up to the right-hand side of the truck. Bounces hard. Kicks the truck to the left-hand side as he turned in to save it. And unfortunately, couldn't bring Bigfoot back around. Up next is Steve Wilkie in the USA 1 Chevrolet. This truck's been around for quite some time. However, this is the first time we have seen it on the Motor Madness Monster Truck Destruction Tour. As he blows through the RV right there, Steve Wilkie knows he's got to lay down one heck of a pass to outdo Gene Patterson in that Bigfoot 10 machine. Gonna take a crack at the vans now. Up and over. Great leap for Steve Wilkie in the USA 1. Looks like he's in a little bit of trouble here as he climbs up over that hill. Oh, bad bounce right there from Wilkie in the USA 1. Up and over the buses. What a leap. Incredible air from Wilkie in the USA 1 Chevrolet as he goes over the vans one more time. What a great performance from this truck and driver. That truck performs incredible out here on this circuit. And over the vans one more time. Oh, sticks it hard into the landing ramp. And Wilkie has that foot stuck through the radiator up and over. And he's going to try to climb over top of the vans one more time. And now he's backing up. That might cost him in his points. Going back over the bus. Huge leap from USA 1 as he really starts to pick up the momentum in this freestyle run to take down Gene Patterson and Bigfoot 10. Huge leap on that center dirt mobile in the center of the track. Going to go for the crush cars. Oh, he's lost a wheel. USA 1 has lost the left front tire. But he's still going on three wheels. This is unbelievable. He's going to go after the bus stack on three wheels. He breaks another wheel up and over. And that'll be it for Steve Wilkie in the USA 1 machine. Let's go back and take a look as he loses the left front tire right here on that dirt. And what a performance by Steve Wilkie in the USA 1 as he keeps going on three wheels. Catch up with this replay right here on three wheels. Takes out this bus stack. Loses the right front tire and the truck goes end over end. Flipping hard, but he brings it back on all two tires. And that'll be a wrap for freestyle. Comment down below who do you think won this freestyle competition. Find my group on Facebook at Monster Truck Attitude where we buy, sell, trade, and auction everything Monster Trucks. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. I'll catch you down the road.